What's up, everybody? Uh, recently, I uh, I put in uh, in the Blu-ray player Cars 2, uh, the Pixar animated film that came out in 2011. The reason why I'm flipping and wailing the case in the air is because it is a 3D case, and I'm not sure that it picks it up on the the camera much. But it is a it's a 3D case because it is a 3D film. It's a, it's a Blu-ray. It's a 3D. Uh, visual copy. Just in case you were wondering, if any of you wanted to pick this thing up, it's a, it's a five disc 3D combo pack. Uh, the disc one is the Blu-ray 3D, disc two is the Blu-ray, disc three the Blu-ray bonus features, disc four is the DVD copy of the film, and disc five is the digital copy. Enough with that. Okay, let's review the film. Uh, Cars 2. It takes place a while after Cars 1, I would say. Uh, a couple, I don't know, months, maybe a year. I, I would say maybe a little more than a year because it illustrates that Lightning McQueen has won a couple of uh, uh, Golden Prix. What are they called? Piston Cups. Uh, <laughs> uh, Lightning McQueen won a couple Piston Cups, four of them or something. And uh, whatever happens, Mater, Lightning McQueen, uh, on this uh, mission. Uh, you know, Lightning, Lightning McQueen, he's, he's got these three races to do. It's called the World Grand Prix, and he's got to do that. And he has to not get exploded or, or whatever is going to happen to him. He needs to be saved. And the person to save him from these problems, we made her because he gets entangled with the wrong people. Uh, and they're dealing with something that, that's just confusing as all hell. Okay, out of that. Uh, the, the, the voice acting in this film... Uh, Owen Wilson, great job with Lightning McQueen. Uh, you know, Larry the Cable Guy. Good uh, job. I, I guess you'd say he he's fine as Mater. You know, it's really, it's it's a comical role. Uh, the first one was based, uh, as we all know, uh, on Lightning McQueen. Why do I keep saying Light McQueen? It's just too we It's just too fast to say. Just you try to say it really fast. Lightning McQueen. Lightning McQueen. Lightning. McQueen. It's just, it's just ridiculous. I keep saying it. How about I say Lightning? I just keep saying Lightning because Lightning McQueen is just. Maybe I'm talking too fast. I, I, I'm not sure. Uh, but Lightning uh, in the first one, the film was about him uh, going to Radiator Springs, uh, getting there uh, on accident, and meeting all these wonderful cars and, and all these new personalities, and uh, finding that that life just doesn't have to be about racing. Uh, it could be about uh, loving other people. Uh, and uh, enjoying the world for, for what it is, I, I guess you could say. It's a very, very uh, interesting movie, Cars 1. Uh, I mean, not my favorite Pixar film. I don't think it was a lot of people's favorite Pixar film, but they decided to go ahead and make a sequel uh, to the Cars movie. Uh, now, the reason why I'm just reviewing this, I'm just putting out there, is because Ellen DeGeneres, a uh, great lady, I, I could watch her, uh, I could watch her show all day long, every day, until I die, and I would not be bored. I really, I just, I, I love her show. Uh, and she announced, officially, uh, they have decided to go ahead and make a Finding Nemo 2 and uh, the, the film is called Finding Dory, and, uh, which is an interesting uh, thing of itself. Uh, do you think Finding Dory should be, uh, should be good? Do you think it would be bad? Do you want to see Finding Dory? Are you excited for the thing? It won't be out until 2015, but what do you think? Put that in the comments section. What do you think about Finding Dory? Uh, so I decided to uh, put this Pixar film in. And uh, Cars 2 is a good Pixar film for what it is. It, it's it's nothing spectacular. It's good. It's fun. I mean, I watched it and I, I I had problems with it, obviously, but I never got really bored because the thing is entertaining to watch. It is a fun movie. It just could be you know confusing at times. Just at times, if you're like a little you know maybe five year old. You, you really might not understand what exactly is going on. Uh, especially like with, with the gasoline they use. There, there's a whole thing with that and it's just it's hard to comprehend with. Oh, well, it's just me. But that's kind of hard to comprehend with. <laughs> uh, so... 
whatever. Cars 2, alright Disney Pixar film, not my favorite. Uh, it really wasn't, it didn't need to be made. I mean, it's really, I mean, you got cars, they're swinging through rooftops, they're shooting other cars, you know, they're, they're picking up flamethrowers, it's just, it's a funky, funky film. Uh, and Cars 2, I'm going to give it a 3.5 out of 5 stars, not because it's bad, just because of, uh, you know, the, the confusingness of it, and, uh, Basically, other than that, the cars swinging off rooftops, rooftop, and then and shooting, and uh, using flamethrowers and and fire and uh, climbing up walls and swinging and attaching to things. It's just, I guess it was cool, but whatever. It's 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 really hard to explain how I feel about that. Uh, so yeah, three point five for cars too. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching this uh, this review uh, of the uh, of the Disney Pixar film. Not not a new film. I just decided to review it. Uh, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna try to review some older films, uh, no matter how old or newer they are. I'd like to try to review some of those uh, good old films for you guys, uh, for your entertainment. So please subscribe, comment, like it up, and uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Over and out. Whoa! I knew I should have done carry on. Cars 2. Good job! Sorry, lady.